Post-game highlights are brought to you by Farmburgessa. Stop by Farmburgessa in Vinton for delicious farm-to-table burgers, or check out their second location in Grandin Village. The Berglund Center in Roanoke, Virginia is once again the backdrop for the seventh game of the 2021-2022 SBHL season for your Roanoke Rail Yard Dogs. The Dogs will try once again to grab their first win of the season tonight against the SBHL's newest expansion team, the Vermilion County Bobcats. We're underway, opening faceoff won by Vermilion County. Now it stubs in the slot, finds Jansen near side, right wing, scores! Mac Jansen fires home! That didn't take long, folks. 55 seconds and it's off a of faceoff. Stubbs find Jansen near side wing and Mac with another goal. Ford looking to the back door, shot blocked away. Jones had another good look. Breaks into the Vermillion zone, tries to lob it to Sherwood. Sherwood ends up picking up a loose puck and scores. Two to nothing, Dogs. 1.59 to go in the first period. That's Sherwood. Sherwood shoots, and he scores again. Brent Sherwood along the goal line near side. Two goals and less than three minutes for Shirzy. Bumping you back here during the first intermission. Dogs three, Bobcats zero through 20 minutes of play. The Dogs leading three to nothing over Vermillion will go right to left in this second period of play. Benelli turns it over. Here goes Jansen. He's one on one with Wilson. He tucks it up top and doesn't find the net. Now it's Stubbs, right wing circle, back to Armstrong. Armstrong winds up, nice pass and a score! Jeff Jones, heady play from Travis Armstrong. He finds his longtime teammate, Jeff Jones, along the back door, far side goal line. It's an easy tap in for Jonesy. Four to nothing, Roanoke with 13.06 left to go, second period. Shuts it in from the point. Rotobush does well to deflect it initially, but it's scored on the rebound attempt by the Bobcats. And now there's a scrap right in front of the net. I believe it's Portillo that's tied up with Armstrong. We haven't seen Armstrong go this year, but I think he might. And Vela's in there too. And that'll do it for period number two. Four to one, dogs. They open up this game with a three to nothing lead through the first period and both teams scoring one in that middle 20 minutes. And now it's crossed back into White and White with the power play goal. Rebound scores, Horvath scores. Rono calls a timeout. Dan Bremner wants to talk it over. Big hit as Ford sent a man into the boards. Sherwood moving towards the right wing. Sends it a shot. He scores! Hat trick for Brent Sherwood! left to go in the third period. The Dogs stop the bleeding and take a 5-3 lead. Jones back to Stubbs, back door, just wide of the glove. And now Jones scores on the rebound off the backboards. It's six to three, another power play goal for your rail yard dogs. Jones is second of the night. Who pick up win number one of the 2021-2022 season. Six to three, rail yard dogs over Vermillion tonight. A five-game point streak now for the Dogs. 
and Brent Sherwood, the hat trick man, wrapping up tonight's star of the game honor. These were your post game highlights brought to you by Farm Burgessa. Be sure to check out Farm Burgessa in Vinton for delicious farm to table burgers or stop by their second location in Grandin Village.